Good afternoon. Uh, welcome to the Spear School of Business graduate hooding ceremony. Uh, my name is Ramesh Sharda. I serve as the Vice Dean for Graduate Programs and Research in Watson Graduate School of Management here in Spears Business. Uh, this afternoon, we are hosting a hooding ceremony for the master's students in Spears School of Business, and we'll also be recognizing a few doctoral graduates. Uh, so on behalf of uh, faculty and staff of Watson Graduate School of Management and Spears School of Business, uh, we congratulate all of the masters and doctoral candidates for their accomplishments. Uh, this is our first hooding ceremony since December 2019, uh, at the conclusion of all 19th semester. Uh, last year in 2020, we graduated uh, 331 masters and doctoral candidates uh, from the graduate programs in Spears Business. And uh, this uh, spring and summer, we are graduating 220 students. Uh, so because of the, uh, all the special requirements for social distancing uh, and uh, masking and so on, we had to play it very safe. I appreciate your cooperation. Uh, but because of that, we did uh, two events. So some of the master's graduates were recognized uh, starting at 2 o'clock, and uh, this is the second event uh, uh, focusing on the uh, MBA, business analytics, data science, graduate certificates, and doctoral programs. Uh, so uh, uh, we've invited all of our uh, 2020 graduates and summer 2021 graduates in this uh, here in the McKnight Center. Obviously, we all know that last 15 months have been really difficult on everybody, especially students. They should be congratulated for tenacity in pushing through the challenges uh, they have faced uh, in keeping up uh, with their classes, many of which were offered uh, in virtual mode uh, and a lot of work on their own. Uh, their families, and friends, guests uh, like you here should be congratulated as well uh, for your support and encouragement of these students. It has been a tough time. Uh, economic uncertainty, all the family challenges, uh, loss of family members and so on, uh, and, and working from uh, uh, home uh, remotely. In fact, uh, I saw my Watson Graduate School of Management Assistant Director and the MBA Program Manager for the first time face-to-face -face in 14 months. Of course, we meet through Zoom multiple times a week, uh, but I'd not seen them face-to-face -face until this afternoon. Uh, so we've gone through a lot of challenges, uh, but uh, our graduates have persevered and they worked hard to achieve these degrees. So now let's move on to celebrating their graduation, okay? They worked for uh, these degrees for two or more years. Uh, uh, such a joyous occasion. Uh, uh, so uh, as they graduate uh, uh, and uh, move on to their careers, I hope that they will recall their experience at OSU fondly. Uh, of course, of, we hope that uh, this is the last time we are having to do graduation ceremony hooding event like this with a mask on. Uh, uh, hopefully everything will be back to normal uh, um, by fall, but uh, uh, we uh, certainly hope that they will recall their time here and will stay in touch. Uh, we should uh, note that because of the current social distancing, uh, McKnight Center requests that our guests do not leave their seats until after the ceremony concludes. So uh, the uh, graduates to be hooded will walk across the stage here, of course, uh, and uh, they'll be waiting uh, outside, but please stay here while the event is going on, and when it concludes, uh, please follow the ushers' uh, guidance in uh, uh, exiting on a timely, orderly basis, okay? There are many people in Spear School of Business who are playing a big role in making these students successful. Uh, in their academic life, so I'm pleased to introduce those, starting with the dean's office. Uh, so, uh, of course, I'll invite uh, Dr. Eastman uh, in a minute here to uh, greet all the graduates. Uh, uh, 
but uh, we have uh, several associate deans uh, uh, who uh, work on various initiatives and various uh, functions. Uh, uh, Spear School of Business also has eight departments, uh, many of which have their own master's programs, but we also have uh, uh, two college-wide uh, master's programs. But uh, first, uh, recognizing all the department heads of the eight departments here, Moving on to the PhD coordinators of uh, these departments, uh, we actually have a PhD program in all eight departments, and we also have a PhD in business for executives program. So we have nine PhD programs. Uh, um, two of these PhD coordinators are concluding their service, uh, Dr. Mary Gedi in economics, uh, uh, and Dr. Dave Biros from MSIS, they are concluding their service, and uh, uh, Dr. Vidisha Lairi from Economics and Dr. Brian Hammer from MSIS will be taking over uh, their charge uh, beginning in Ju July. Moving on to master's program coordinators. Again, we have several master's programs uh, in Spears Business. Uh, we recognize graduates of some of those programs earlier, and uh, uh, the, the other program that I mentioned earlier will be recognized, uh, their graduates will be recognized here in a little bit. Uh, we uh, also want to recognize our MBA program uh, faculty fellows who play a big role in teaching core courses, as well as uh, in working with the students uh, to enhance their work experience, their experience in the program, activities, and so on. So uh, this slide uh, introduces all of the MBA core faculty fellows. Uh, we also have several other MBA faculty colleagues uh, who teach in the program, and I'm pleased to recognize them on the next slide. Um, so there's the MBA faculty support. And finally, as I mentioned earlier, MS in Business Analytics Data Science is another college-wide master's program supported by uh, School of uh, Marketing and International Business, as well as Management Science Information System Department. So faculty members of uh, uh, those two departments uh, select a colleague from them. They form the core faculty group for uh, the MS Band program, and they are recognized here. And finally, the group uh, that puts this event and many of the events together, as well as serves uh, um, most of the students in uh, Spears Business, graduate students in Spears Business, the Watson Graduate School of Management staff, uh, that's uh, recognized on this slide. Uh, uh, Deb Cooper from uh, this group. Uh, uh, students have received emails from her multiple times, so they already know her name. Uh, she led the effort to organize all the events uh, along with the help from all the other staff members here as well as our Greenwood online uh, learning staff, uh, Shona Gambrill and uh, uh, Jeremy. So uh, now uh, let me in, uh, invite Dean Eastman. Uh, Dr. Eastman actually served as an MBA program director uh, before becoming a department head and eventually dean. So uh, he has long connections to the graduate programs. I invite him to uh, greet all the graduates. Thank you, Dr. Sharda. We are delighted that you're here to support your graduates. Uh, what a difference a year makes. So uh, we hope the trend continues. But uh, we're very proud of the students. Uh, they certainly have shown resilience and tenacity to not only just get through their academic programs, but deal everything the pandemic threw at them. So I, I think they deserve an extra little bit of boost for <laughs> their perseverance in keeping that going. So you should be very proud of them. We're proud of you uh, for the support you gave them. Uh, and we're particularly proud of the students and their ability to move forward. And we look forward to what they're gonna accomplish. And we always tell the students, don't be strangers. We wanna see how your life unfolds. So again, we're delighted to have you here. Welcome, and we look forward to celebrating with you. Thank you. Thank you, Ken. Uh, uh, I also want to offer a special welcome to 14 of our online uh, learning students. Many of them uh, have come from far. For many of them, this may be their first trip to the land of orange. 
We are glad to see them here and welcome them and their families to Stillwater and the OSU campus. Okay. So a special welcome to our uh, uh, online learning students. Uh, our graduating uh, uh, candidates are ready for the event. I can see this here, so let's begin. Uh, several of our faculty members, including myself, will be reading the names of our graduates as they walk across the stage. We put together a slideshow that should coordinate with the order of the students being hooded. Uh, I know we have a couple of uh, uh, folks who are not here, but, but uh, hopefully we'll be able to coordinate it. Uh, each slide introduces uh, a master's candidate being hooded this afternoon. Uh, the slide should uh, keep things interesting, and we believe uh, you will learn a little bit about uh, their plans uh, and their desires and so on. Uh, since this is our second event and we uh, have a uh, little more uh, leeway in terms of uh, time, uh, I'll allow a little bit of levity and uh, we'll also read a little bit about uh, what they have shared with us, uh, uh, so we'll, we'll do that. Well, please note that we have a photographer uh, who will be taking a uh, photo of the hood being placed. We request that uh, personal photographers take all the photos they wish, but not here. Uh, right from your seat and not approach the stage. And of course, you can also do that outside, okay? So uh, Dr. Sarah Chavinek will introduce the first group of candidates from the Master of Science in MI, uh, the uh, Business Analytics Data Science Program. Thank you, Dr. Sharda. If Dr. Chakraborty will step up to the picture taking area. Our first candidate from our Master of Science in Business Analytics and Data Science is Caitlin Byrne. She is being hooded today by her father, Dr. Jesse Byrne, who is a faculty member at the University of Central Oklahoma. Our next up is Navjad Kaur. And I should have mentioned Dr. Godam Chakraborty is hitting the rest of our business analytics and data science students. Next is Srijita Biswas. Jaya Batia. Miriam Tahariani. Priyabrata Thate. Harshit Agarwal. <laughs> Sai Teja Sagi.
Alvi Mahmood. M.D. Enamul Hassan. <laughs> Brittany Hickerson. Ashish Arjun Bugalia. <laughs> Caroline Reichard. Samia Patra. <laughs> Nikhil Gunti. Aspen Schmidt. <laughs> Venkat Ram Reddy. Yusha Pustaria. <laughs> Mancy Moorday. Trin Fan. <laughs> Sugandhi Akula.
Varun Bhatia. Ayusha Gupta. Rohan Gupta. Nihal Reddy. Yogesh Dingra. Arvind Donabal. Trishla Mishra. Akil Imani. Sahil Gandhi. <laughs> Sumit Dambla. Ravani Sigdom. Tarun Alapati. Vanil Rayala. (laughs) 
Maruthi Shankar Nanduri. Melissa Reed. <laughs> Anirud Vem. Rusha Putam. Sitong <laughs> Hu. Venki Konduri. <laughs> Nikhil Viswanath. Chima. <laughs> Menoj Reddy Ginjala. Nathisha Kata. <laughs> Joss Winder Singh. Arindam Mukherjee. <laughs> Nikhil 
Neil Belford. Bhavna Irukula. <laughs> Kalyan Kumar Alizetti. Nitesh Maruti. <laughs> Ashish Pamu. Cyril Johnson. <laughs> Harish Reddy Patlala. Noah Heinrich. <laughs> Pankajdeer Bikumala. Sai Gopi Krishna Govinda Rajula. All right, Dr. Sharda. I will turn the podium back over to you. Thank you, Dr. Chakraborty. So, is he here? Is he here? Nope. Okay. You're going to India. Okay. Then I just oh, here. here you can. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Now we are uh, starting the uh, MBA program. Who is? Um, so uh, the um, first one to who is uh, Kenneth Kern actually uh, met. Uh, uh, so uh, the first graduate is Alison Ray. 
Alison, congratulations. Okay. Next uh, to be hooded is uh, uh, Anna Beffer with uh, uh, to be hooded by Karen Hancock. Next MBA graduate to be hooded uh, is uh, Josh Martinez Lopez and to be hooded by Dr. Federico Aime. Dr. Bowler can uh, take over hooding the rest of the MBA graduate group. So the first one to be hooded is uh, Cheyenne Yeager. Okay. okay. Next uh, graduate is Carly Freirier. Next graduate is Lauren Fike. While they're being hooded, uh, if I have time, I'll read uh, their notes. So uh, Lauren would like to win big money on Wheel of Fortune, my favorite show as well. Uh, next, uh, is, uh, uh, next graduate is Kelly Ebert, and she would be hooded by uh, um, Abby Davis. Sorry. Just had a complete mental block. I do know Abby's name. She's my neighbor. <laughs> Congratulations, Kelly. OK, going back to Dr. Bowler. OK, next graduate is uh, Justin Hull. Next graduate is Samana Libigat. She would like to compete on the prices right. Okay. Our next graduate to be honored is uh, Nadine uh, Gonzalez. Next honor, Corey James. And Corey wants to compete on survival. Okay. Next graduate is Carly Bender. And Carly would like to share a meal with our new incoming president, Casey Shrum, Dr. Casey Shrum, and Pistol Pete, of course. So. <laughs> Next graduate is uh, uh, Roger Benos Rangel, and he would like to compete. He's not here? All right, okay. 
Then next is Richard Lawson. Yeah. All right. Our next MBA honoree is uh, Leslie Ann Burns, and she would also like to be a contestant on The Price is Right. Okay. Next graduate is Ryan Schaefer. Our next graduate is Paula Gwinnip. Okay. Next graduate is Ashlyn Grace Hughes. Okay, we next honor Courtney Wolf uh, McNally. Okay. Okay. Next, we honor Madison Gustin. Our next graduate is Imin Amiri. Is Imin is not here? Okay, we'll move on to Alison Belanger. <laughs> All right. And she wants to compete on who wants to be a millionaire. Sorry. Sorry. Next, we have Andrea Schott. Okay. And next, we have Andrea uh, Novakovic. All right. Then we have Caroline Becker. Okay. Now we honor Daniel Castle. And Daniel would like to compete on Shark Tank and obtain an offer from Mark Cuban. I'm watching for Next, we have uh, Mary Foley. to Garrett Stevenson. Okay, uh, next we honor Brian Seal.
All right. Our next honoree is uh, Mads uh, Bizignani. Please set that right, Mads. And she wants to compete on Family Feud. Next, we have Bernie Houston Morris. Bernie, congratulations. And then we have Ashley Springfield. And uh, Kenneth Kern is coming back to Hood Hill. Okay, our uh, uh, next two honorees are doctoral graduates. Doctoral graduates get hooded at the Graduate College Hooding this evening, uh, but we still want to recognize them. So first uh, is uh, Talal uh, Abu Hulayla, and uh, he's uh, being uh, hooded or uh, being recognized by doc uh, Dr. Lisa Slavich, PhD coordinator of uh, HTM. And we have uh, another PhD graduate being recognized, uh, Dr. Matt Rutherford, uh, would, would recognize uh, Dugu Phillips from School of Entrepreneurship. Okay, I think uh, that completes uh, our uh, uh, recognizing all the uh, honorees this evening. Uh, so congratulations. Let's, let's give a big round of applause to all of our graduates uh, who are of such. And congratulations to the families and friends again. Thank you again for joining us today. Uh, uh, thank you to all the faculty members and Dr. Chabinak and all the other colleagues for reading the names, suiting them, and so on. Um, want to remind you that commencement ceremonies this evening uh, will be in Boone Pickens uh, Stadium at 7 p.m. Uh, if you plan to attend that, please go there at 6 o'clock. Uh, uh, because of uh, enhanced security measures, uh, the entrances to the stadium may take a little bit of extra time, so arrive um, as close to six or earlier as possible, okay? And I also want to thank the McKnight Center staff, of course, the Watson Graduate School of Management team, online learning team, um, who all work together under uh, Deb Cooper's uh, leadership and put all of this event together. So. Hopefully next year we'll be doing one big event and uh, we'll have a lot of fun. Uh, but uh, nevertheless, all of our graduates deserve a big round of applause. So again, uh, thank you for attending the event and have a good evening. <laughs>